Okay, we are back. Okay, gotta remember what the hell my controls are. Jeez. All right. So how it works is each palace has an item, and it has a boss for you to defeat. Now those guys you can kill; they don't give you any experience, but if they touch you, they steal experience. So sometimes I like to be all cocky and jump them. Okay, that was a one magic uh, bar refill. The the red one, if it's or sorry, blue one. If it's red, that means you get a full refill. That was a Stelphos. Anyway, now that I've hit 200, I got my pick. So if I chose this one, I'd only lose 50 of my experience points. But I don't need any life, and I don't need a magic refill. So I'm just going to take the attack. Hooray, so now I've got more power. Awesome, a power. Oh, I don't think so. Knife in the face. All right, that's a key. you got to stab keys with your sword to pick them up for some reason. Makes sense to me. I don't know how you guys pick up your keys, but I always stab them with my small little blade. By the way, apparently that is the magical sword he is using. So I don't know what happened to it, but the thing has less length than his arm. Well, that was cool. I slid under the elevator. That, that was pretty fun. I gotta tell you, they make a nice sound when they die. And there goes my key. Just like Legend of Zelda, they're one-time uses only. Oh, I don't think so. I do not think so. Yay. I'm just trying to confuse the enemies. Yeah, that's it. What have we got? Oh, another Stalfos. I always knew that those stabbing skeletons in the leg lessons would pay off. Oh, wow, that was terrible. The hell was I thinking? Um, you know, since I'm actually going to do some grinding in here, and yeah, somebody said they'll be grinding in this, this, this talk through. Good for you, you got it right. See these skell... These skells, the skull balls, they take forever to hurt. But don't worry, I'm sure I've already started fast forwarding this for you guys. Yeah, they take a lot of hits to kill, but they're worth 50 experience points. You can't really argue with that. And they regenerate. That's what makes them so valuable to farm. So I'm gonna farm them for a third attack power level. Come on, you know you wanna die. Wow, that really does take a long time. All right, so we're farming away. Do -de -do -de -do -do. Now they don't drop uh, any items or anything like that, so basically. They're just 50 screen points and you won't get screwed over with a magic jar showing up. However, you won't get the bonus of a money bag or a pee bag, points bag as they're called, showing up. Uh, it's like every sixth or seventh enemy you kill that you can drop stuff, they will, you know, give you either magic refill or extra points, uh, uh, you know, although some enemies, or so yeah, some enemies will actually give you something that's worth less. Doesn't make any sense whatsoever. Yeah. So it's gonna be one of those where you grind away and grind away. Grind away and grind some more. Well, I don't know. I wish there was something to talk about in the game. Oh no, is this game doesn't get really tough. Like, this first palace, when you first start, it's kinda tough. And you get the caves at first, kind of tough, but the game doesn't really pick up until you hit Death Mountain. And then the game just turns you over the nearest park bench and proceeds to ram you from behind for a while until you master dealing with Darius or Darius. Ah, flickety flick. And then, just to make it that much worse. Oh yeah, so it gets worse. Just when you get that down, then you're going start dealing with Moas. And you're like, what's a Moa? Well, you know what, you don't gotta worry about Moas just yet. And for every cool thing they give you in this game, like a nice magic spell, they give you a life spell soon enough in the game. They respond by making enemies more and more insane. Yeah, it's not the easiest game in the world, but with practice you can get quite good at it. God, that sword is just driving me nuts. Okay, that's enough of that. You're dead. What's over here? Okay, if I need, ever need a life refill, I come back here, because that's a fairy. Oh, it's already used its sound. The cool fairy sound. So, we'll go up here, and what do we get? We get more of the hopping idiots. That's, that's fantastic. Sucker. There's a key. Hooray. Now, you may remember that elevator I skipped earlier. The reason I skip, skipped it earlier was that I need to have some keys to go down there. Actually, I only need one, so I could go back there right now, but there's another key down here for me to grab. And we meet our first... Well, I always called them bone chuckers when I was younger, but I don't really know what their names are, to tell you the truth. Because th he's not chucking a bone. He's chucking a mace. Well, he's chucking nothing now because he's dead. Now, sometimes when you stab iron knuckle statues, they either drop a magic jar, or an iron knuckle itself will pop out. And iron knuckles are really nasty to deal with. Now, there's a cheap way to kill them, and I'll show you that, but I prefer to fight them properly. 
Mainly just because that's how I taught myself to play the game. I didn't find out about the cheap kill until years later. God bless the internet, eh? Oh, there's no, uh, no jar from him. I'm shocked. Could have swore you'd get a jar out of that one. No, come back here. I want to kill you. No. There you go. Now you did. Okay, so let's go back to the left. I can kill another skull if I want. Now see how he's stuck? That's a little glitch in the game. You can stick them wherever you want like that and make them do what you want. They can do some weird stuff. They can get themselves stuck up around the, where the, the menu, or sorry, the menus, your life bar, magic bar, experience stuff. They can get stuck up there sometimes. Like, here's an easy place for them to do it. Where's the skulls? There he is. Alright. Go. Leave him behind. Okay. Oh, there's a fast one. That's nice. Jeez, how many are in this freaking room? Oh, goody. Guess what I do? I'm killing more. Yay, killing. Killing is fun. Hooray, killing. This is probably the better room to to actually do do the raising in, but you know what? First place I found was the other one, so that's what I'm going to stick with. Come on, die. Don't make me sing. I know you guys don't want to hear singing. No singing. Oh, we're going to sing soon. Oh, you guys got lucky. All right, what do we got? Sucker. Yay, okay. This bridge crumbles. Sure if you can hear that or not. Oh, I didn't stab. Get it on the way back. Whee! Ha ha! I am brilliant. All right, I think we meet our first iron knuckle in here. No, maybe not. Maybe just maybe it's just a bone, a bone chucker. God, I used to think of how much these things you stuff used to clean my clock in this game. This game is basically about. Oh, that's nice. You'll get two hundred for that. So we'll take the attack. We'll get a little tougher. All right, good start. Now iron knuckle, yeah. So. Wow, okay, seriously? That never happens. He didn't raise his defense once. He was just like, you know what? You can stab me in the face four straight times. That's ridiculous. Alright, here's the first item. We got a candle. Hooray! Now we must backtrack to get onwards. Okay, I don't know. I was planning to sing there, and then I decided not to, and I already started. So it sounded kind of, what's the word? Ah! Oh, that does me a lot of good. Thanks a lot. Oh, shoot! Almost fell in the lava. Look at that bridge crumble. Oh, well. Ah, shit happened. Oh, no. That's not very nice. Ah! No, go away! That's a good little skull ball that's way too fast. He's on crack, I swear to God. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Oh, bastard! After I trusted you, never ever trust anything. Yay! Refill of life! Alright, let's go down, let's go finish this thing. Alright, here's another one. Now here's... Oh god, I'm sort of practice at that. Now, the orange ones, to be fair, the orange ones are pretty poor swordsmen. Actually, to be fair, they're really bad swordsmen. 300, can I get up to that? I hope so. Because if I can, I'm going to be supremely pissed. Because anytime you f put a crystal into a, uh... Into a, uh... Statue... You will get, uh, you get your next, uh, you reach your next experience level for, uh, leveling up. So, it's, sometimes people will not put crystals into the end of the game and they'll store them up. So they can build up a ton of extra lives. However, I'm too hardcore good at this game to have to do that cheap maneuver. Okay, die. Oh, you bum! Oh, that screws the whole plan. Okay, I'm gonna call it a video. And I'll be back to this section. So until next time, I'm Brian Solver. Keep your stick on the ice.